Hello and welcome back to the Master Civil Engineering. In the last video, we learned that how to find the reduced level of any point that is above the line of sight of the instrument using the inverted staff reading. And in this video, we will learn that how to record the measurements in the record book when we have multiple inverted staff readings. You can see that I have been given a figure in which I have to find the reduced level at the station B, station C, station D and station E. And in this figure, you can see that for station C and station E, we are placing the staff inverted. Okay, we have to find the reduced level of the bottom of this girder and bottom of this uh, slab. So first we have to make a uh, leveling table, okay, in which we have seven columns. That is first one is the station, second one is the back side, third one is the intermediate side column, fourth one is the four side column, fifth one is the height of instrument column, Sixth one is the reduced column and seventh one is the remax column. So we are taking the first reading on a benchmark which is at station A. So this benchmark has a reduced level of 50.5 meter. Okay, and the first reading which you are taking, this is equal to 0.174. Since the first reading is always the back side, so first you will write in station column as station A and you will write this 0.174 in the backside column that is 0 0.174 this station has a reduced level of 50.5 meters so write 50.5 meter in the reduced level uh, column and for the remarks column you will write it as a benchmark okay height of an instrument this is simply equal to the reduced level plus backside so you will uh, select the height of column for the station A, write equal sign, then select this reduced level that is 50.5 and to it at the back side which is 0 0.174 and you will get the height of instrument which is 50.674. Okay. After that the next station, this is station B, so write station B and we can see that after taking the reading on the staff at station B we are changing the position of instrument so it means this is our foresight so write this 2.11 in the foresight column okay so this is our first change point so write in the remarks table as c dot p that is change point reduced level of this station B this is simply equal to height of instrument minus this foresight so select the reduced level of station B Write equal sign, then select the height of instrument, okay, which is 50.6 and 4, and from it subtract the foresight, which is 2.111. And press enter, and you will get the reduced level of station B, which is 48.563. Okay, to get the reduced level, you simply have to subtract uh, foresight from the height of instrument. Since this is our change point and we are shifting the position of the instrument. The next reading which is taken on the same station uh, but this is the back side is equal to 0 0.738. So in the same row write 0 0.738 in the back side column that is 0 0.738. Okay and height of instrument this is again equal to the reduced level of the station plus the back side. So reduced level of the station this is equal to 48.563. So select height of instrument of this station B, write equal sign, then select 48.563 and to it add back side, which is 0 0.738 and you will get the height of instrument at this next instrument position. Okay, after that for station C, you can see that for this station, uh, staff is placed inverted okay again after this station we are changing the position of instrument so this reading that is 3.890 is again the foresight uh, and it is negative because the staff is inverted so write in the foresight column as this reading as minus 3.890 okay and this is our second change point reduced level of this uh, station C this is equal to uh, height of instrument minus the foresight 
okay so it will be 49.301 minus minus 3.89 that is you have to add this 3.89 to 49.301 to get the reduced level of station c so select the reduced level of station c right equal sign then select the height of instrument at this station which is 49.301 and from it subtract the four side which is minus 3.89 and press enter and you will get the reduced level of station c which is 53.191 okay again uh, we are changing the position of instrument after taking this reading so next reading will be our back side so we have to write the next reading in the same row but in the back side column again this is also inverted staff reading so write this back side reading as negative that is minus 1.603 and press enter height of instrument this is equal to reduced level of the station plus back side so select the height of instrument of the station c write equal sign then select the reduced level at the station which is 53.191 and to it at the back side which is minus 1.603 okay so height of instrument at the station is 51.588 after that the next station which is the station d okay so again we can see uh, after taking the reading on staff at station d you are changing the position of instrument so this is again our foresight so write this 1.440 in the foresight column okay and this is again our change point so in the remarks write c dot p so reduced level of the station again this will be equal to the height of instrument which is 51.588 minus 1.44 so select reduced level uh, column of the station d write equal sign then select 51.588 and from it subtract the foresight which is 1.44 and press enter and you will get the reduced level of the station d which is 50.148 meters next reading which is 1.505 this will be our back side so write it in the same row but in the back side column which is 1.505 okay and height of instrument at the station this will be equal to the reduced level plus back side so it will be 50.148 plus the back side which is 1.505 and press enter so this will be our uh, height of instrument after changing the instrument next the last reading this is always our foresight we can see at station e we are taking the last reading since again the staff is inverted at this uh, station so you will write the last reading that is 2.192 in the back side column but with a negative sign so write minus 2.192 in the foresight column and for the station right station e okay the reduced level of this station this will be equal to height of instrument minus the foresight so it will be 51.653 minus this minus 2.192 okay and press enter so this will be 53.845 this will be the reduced level of the last station okay so we have to apply the usual check out the leveling that is summation of backside minus summation of foresight this should be equal last reduced level minus first reduced level so first find the summation of the backside so write sum okay then select this backside column write equal sign then write sum then write bracket and select these readings then close the bracket and press enter so this is our sum or backside which is 0 0.814 then similarly select the foresight column write equal sign then write sum write bracket and select all of these readings close the bracket and press enter and you will get the sum of the foresights which is minus 2.531 now let us check summation of backside minus foresight select this column write equal sign then select the summation of back sides which is 0 0.814 and from it subtract the summation of 
four sides which is minus 2.531 and press enter and you can see that summation of back side minus four side this is equal 3.345 now let us check the difference of last reduced level minus first reduced level so select this column write equal sign then select the last reduced level which is 53.845 and from it subtract the first reduced level which is 50.5 and press enter and you can see we again get the value of 3.345 okay so it means our calculations are correct okay because summation of back side minus summation of four side this is equal to last reduced level minus first reduced level okay so this way you can record your measurements in the record book when you have multiple inverted staff readings okay i hope this solution video was clear and you learned something new if you find my video helpful please subscribe to my channel and share this video thanks for watching and stay tuned